Hey guys, my name is Marnice and this is my painting creative life channel and today I wanted to do a quick artist update diary video. I haven't made one in about a month and I've wanted to but I've just been so busy. I haven't been painting as much and that's a shame. Um, nowhere near the daily painting like I wanted to. But I did want to just say a few things that I've noticed since I've started painting. I've been painting about six months now and I took notes. Um, so the first thing I've noticed since I started painting um, regularly is that I'm noticing color differently um, than I used to. So obviously colors all around us, it's in every single thing, but I don't think I really noticed it. You know, you notice it, but I don't think I actually like focus on color. Now I'm looking at out my window and I'm seeing the different greens that are in the trees and I looked at my sister's face and she has a really yellow undertone and I've been staring at my dogs and they're not just brown and white or black and white they have different mixes different colors grays and um, kind of reddish colors and I just basically I wear glasses but I can really see them <laughs> Um, and it's just been an amazing thought. I actually have been seeing intensely and picking out colors. Um, I haven't been using this much. I, again, I haven't been painting much, but just the idea that I'm looking at things, I'm seeing it differently has been so great. Another thing I noticed that I'm paying attention to people, posture, position, um, stances, just the way people present themselves how they move I've been um, very intensely um, eye stalking people basically because um, I'm interested I think I'm mostly interested in painting the human form um, I like so far the pieces that I do that are of people um, I love figure paint painting and I'm sure there's a more technical word for it but I I really am interested in it and so I find myself if I see um, my grandmother tilting her head a certain way while she's thinking I'm looking at how she's holding herself the shadows that are coming because she's holding herself a certain way um, and again this is just me as in now as I guess an artist um, as me looking and seeing things differently which is absolutely wonderful another thing I've been doing is taking in the view I know people say that you get you get rich you get older you get wiser and you start to taking your view but since I've been painting I've really started to understand what that means I have a window in front of my desk where I work out of and I literally spend half of my day staring out my window to see what's going on around me um, when I'm going out I'm looking around at the scene and I haven't brought that back home into my painting yet but I feel like one day when I've gotten to a certain level I'll be able to see something outdoors and I'll be able to bring it back to to the workspace and recreate that because I'm so intensely putting just a scene around me to memory. Um, oh, so basically all of the things I've noticed have to do with my viewpoint. It's changing and it's changing for the better, I think. I'm noticing people more. Um, if you notice what the light is, I'm looking at my phone. But um, I'm noticing people more. People, I used to be one of those people who always had a head in her book literally while walking because I'm always reading 100% of the time. I have three or four books in my bag, not including my Kindle at any point, just in case I get to read. I'm one of those people who read multiple books at a time. Um, and basically, I've been putting down my books <laughs> and looking around and, and noticing people. I was in the mall the other day and I was just looking around at people, different styles of clothing they were wearing. They're different. I just, I just noticed these things now. So, um, and another thing I've finally noticed is that I've slowed down more. Um, again, this is all about my perspective, perspective changing since I started painting. I have